so hey guys welcome back to another video from android beast so as you can see we later mali version 1.8 released and with this update we just got some new features like mono and geek offline installer is now added and experimental wrappers like d3d8 to 9 is also added and with that we just got some game fixes like far cry 1 is fixed and uh, new game preset is also added like drivers and francisco okay so with that we just got some update related to box 64 it's now updated to its latest version okay now glib version is also updated and uh, but as you can see that they have removed certain game presets like oblivion and skyrim preset is removed from the uh, i think uh, it should be removed only from the glib version that's because it doesn't support uh, turning off the wow 64 and which is necessary to run the skyrim game then uh, far cry 4 and nv game preset is also removed and as they have said it's because of the graphical issues and they have fixed uh, the mesa 22.1.7 which was not working earlier and also fixed the date space game presets okay that's it so here if you just scroll down you'll find out all the installer apk files so i will recommend you to install the second one which says winlet uh winlet and mali apk as it does support most of the games including skyrims okay so let's quickly install it and let me quickly show you the setup and also we are going to show you a gameplay so let's quickly begin so we are into the win letter now let me quickly show you how you can set up win letter mali okay so for that you can just click on this plus icon and here you will find out lot of settings so from here you don't have to basically change anything uh, because all the settings are optimized as per the uh, mali devices so what you can change from here is actually you can change the screen sizes as per your game need and if you want more performance out of your games now if you want you can just check this thing which says source performance now uh, another thing that you can change from here is box 86 and 64 preset and you can change it to performance if you want to get better performance in games but uh, this can make the game unstable and sometimes some games doesn't work with this preset uh, they just crash so uh, you can keep this preset to performance uh, because most of the games uh, actually work with the performance preset without an issue so by clicking on this blue button your uh, container will be ready now let's just run this container okay so let me quickly try one game and let's find out how it's performing okay so just go inside the so here i have one game that is devil may cry 4 let's try this one only and let's find out how this is performing since the game has started but there is no uh, fps hard in the top left corner um, i think there is some issues with this new update so let's just uh, bring the virtual gamepad so here as you can see our virtual gamepad is there okay so uh, as you can see black screen so to fix this uh, what we have to do we have to install this thing so just go to start menu click on the install button now just go here and uh, find out wind d3d and just install this one wind d3d version 4.13 uh, this will going to fix the uh, devil may cry for black black screen issue so after that just open it and you will find the magic that game will actually fix without any kind of issue wow as you can see the fps hard is also started to show okay so our graphics is back there is no more uh, game black screen issue so here let me quickly change few settings because uh, as you can see that uh, um, the uh, resolution is also 720p now just change the texture resolution to low okay now just change the shadow quality to off and overall quality to low just exit
okay let's wait for it so uh, another thing that you can do from here just go to this option go to process affinity check this one click ok that's it guys now click on this start now let's try the first mission okay so performance is not bad guys on as per the mali devices currently i'm using dimensity 1200 chipset and as you can see all the things is working fine game is actually performing not bad and we are at 720p guys just remember it was 720p if you if you, if you res lower the resolution to 800 by 600 the game will actually perform much better but still we are managing to get almost 50 to 60 fps that's crazy now let's find out okay but my phone is actually um hitting too much guys okay okay now just kill this man okay so he's died no he's not died so i think everyone has died right no not everyone guys uh, this one yeah okay so everyone almost died guys so let's move to the next place so that's it for now guys my phone is uh, hitting too much i uh, cannot continue this game uh, anymore so let me quickly uh, show you my uh, specification so as you can see guys i am using a dimensity 1200 chipset so that's it for now if you guys have any queries any issues any doubt you can just comment and if you are new to this channel you can subscribe goodbye